So once you've got a model that you like and you've downloaded it, I would have a little look at it in Blender. See whether it's all good and ready to actually be animated and stuff. So go file import, uh, check the file type, right click properties, details. This is a 3D object, ah, dot .obj, there you go. So it should be an obj, find that file. Ooh, once that's imported, looks like it's all good to go. All I'm gonna do is just delete the head. I'm gonna be plopping it in. You can go up here, object mode, change that to edit mode. Uh, select this and go control L to select link. Press delete, any of these vertices. Do that again, control L, delete. Sweet, so now we've got Optimus Prime, just the body. Back to object mode. Might just position this a little higher. So when you're importing your character into Mixamo, you want it to be in a T pose really. So if it's not, you might need to change the actual geometry to, to make Mixamo read it well. When you got your object here, select your object, go down to edit mode, and you can select your points then. It's with the box selection. And then you can press Control L, that selects all linked. Now you can rotate and you know as long as it's a little more symmetrical i think that's going to do for what we for what we want oh yeah also you you might want x-ray view turned on up here that means that when you make your selection it's not just selecting the visible visible points in one line it's selecting see this is without x-ray just these are selected with x-ray selected it selects all the way through. So that's really useful for when you've got a load of little points going on here. Again, this, so let's go into a different view here. Take off X-ray, go back into object mode. That's, that's looking fine for what we want to use it for. Okay, so now we got a bit of a better pose going on. We can re-export that. Prime armor. So taking the head away, we've got the pose right. Next video, we will actually look at getting this into Mixamo and getting some animations on it.